There are big differences, uh, especially in terms of, 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 of principles and approaches between the Bodhi from the original movie and the Bodhi that, that was written and the one that I'm, that I'm playing for, for, for our movie, for, for Point Break. Um, uh, but the, but the, the anti-system spirit, the, 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 the search, the, the search beyond the thrill that, 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 that this character, um, that we saw in this character in the first movie is still in this one. The scale is completely, is completely different. I mean, this movie has been, I mean, the, I mean in, this, in, this, in this reimagination of the story of Point Break, we're taking Point Break and the, and the movie to the world. So, so the, movie, the movie plays on a, on a, on a, on a global scale. Um, it doesn't only sur it doesn't only revolve around the the, the world of, of big wave surfing. Um, the movie takes on other 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 um, extreme sports or extreme extreme activities. In comparison to the first one, uh, the pack of wolves, which is the wolf pack, that's how we we call Bodhi's gang in the movie. Um, they're not necessarily actually they're not looking for the endless summer. I mean, they're looking for something uh, more extreme and, and in a way uh, more profound and way more dangerous. I mean, this, this, these guys are militants and they are, they are political militants, um, environmental uh, activists. Without getting hung up in the artificial spirituality of it all, because um, these guys are guys of action and they take it very ser seriously and they go straight for the action and for, 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 what it, for what it needs to be done. There's definitely a spiritual element that impregnates uh, whatever they do. So th these guys are ideological guys. So they, they strongly believe in ideology. They, they, they can tell exactly what is wrong from what is right in terms of our relationship with the earth and the impact that, that human beings have been having, the, the negative impact that we've been having on the planet. These guys come from different places in the world. They, they speak different languages. They are very keen with technology. They rub against money without, um, without um, being tempted, without being uh, infected. Um, they actually, they infiltrate the system. They, 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 they have infiltrated the system. They understand, they understand the rules so that they can break them without the system finding out that they're breaking those rules. So without revealing too much, these guys, they do intelligence. I mean, they do intel, they have infiltrated the system, they use, what, they, they use the system's resources to accomplish what, they've, what they feel and believe that is right um, for, for, for the earth and, and according to, his, to, their, to their ideological beliefs. I don't know if people are going to go out and fight for what they believe the freedom is when they walk out the, when they walk out the theater from watching the movie, but at least to feel that for a, for, for a moment, you know, in a dark, in a dark theater and, and, and to dream about the possibility of feeling really alive and, uh, and, 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 and being conscious of, 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 of the limited amount of time that we have on this earth and try to do something um, something valuable with it according to your own beliefs and according to what you, you, you think that, 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 according to your values, I think that is a great thing. And, 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 and I believe that that's what has made this movie so, so unique, this story so, um, uh, so current, you know? And I think that's why a movie like Point Break deserves uh, a reimagination. We got the most um, uh, amazing and respected people in extreme sports uh, of this world in this movie, and and that and, and that you know that that really excites me, because uh, not not only not, not not only gives authenticity to the story, uh, it also it also inspire you 
to go out and do something that you feel fun, to challenge yourself, you know, but not because of ego, not because you want to be number one, because one thing that all these guys have in common is that they, 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 couldn't, they, couldn't, they couldn't care less about being number one. It's about the search, what lies beyond the challenge, what you can gain as a human being if you push yourself to what you consider is your limit. And, uh, and, and this movie, I mean, I'm so, I'm so grateful to so, so many people that have put their lives um, on the line. I mean, they have really risked their lives to make us look amazing in this movie. We have stunts in this movie. We have, we have, we have sequences that have never, done bef have never been done before. Outside or inside cinema, never done before. You know, the wingsuiting, the, 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 the snowboard sequences. I mean, we got Xavier de la Rue uh, working with us, Lerr Hamilton, Jeb Corliss, Chris Sharma, among many, many, many other great athletes working with us and pushing themselves to the very limit for this movie. Hi, it's Valerie here with a little bit of love. Did you know the voice actors of Vicky Mouse and Minnie Mouse from the 1930s got married in real life? For this and more movie facts, click on more videos.